team squad. We're about to take a second. We're about to go. Alpha, Opa. Alpha, Opa. Alpha, Opa. Yeah. Pablo, we got Mom Alpha. over here. We got Ivy. We got Sam. Sam, those are some pretty nice pants there. Opa, Alpha, Opa, Alpha, Opa, Alpha, Opa, So, there are so many of these kiosks here where you can buy anything. Like Sudoku, newspapers, gum. Pretty much like a little. What is the word I'm looking for? It's like a, a little stop and go shop. Something weird just happened. So some of us in our group didn't have tickets, or we had a student ticket. And apparently in Greece, in order to have a student ticket, you need to go to public universities. You can't go to a college or a private university. So we got fined, a lot of us got fined for it. Except for me and Manos. For some odd reason, they let hey us guys. pass through. That's how you know that God exists. We're trying to find the bathroom. And uh, it's not going well right now. We found the bathroom. So Al Bors got arrested in Germany, in Germany in but because they thought he was a terrorist. <laughs> and do I look like a terrorist? I don't think you I'm do. A, I'm a I student, don't think man. You know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> We found a pizza place. Amanda's happy. We're all sitting down. We got seated like that. We got Al boys in front of us. Now say Paracalo. Paracalo. <laughs> How cool is this one? We got this beautiful man over here. They just got two haircuts. Today so far, pretty good day, even though we got some rough patches. We still got pizza coming our way. Am I right? Or am I right? You got a men. It seems like all throughout Europe, it's the same bathroom, it just says women and men, and there's really no difference in it. We got a back! Got back. I lost this bad boy for about 20 minutes, left it at the pharmacy. And then Yonisus over here came with me. We got a taxi, got it back. Vlogs are still happening, this big jump's still happening. We good. When did we wake up, guys? 4:30. By 4:30 a.m. If you heard that right. I haven't been woken up. This is amazing. I am digging this. Ah, and there's Kimmy. What's up, Kimmy? What's up, Kimmy? Yeah. This is honestly so beautiful. And the, look at this. The water is so clear. You can see the rocks. You can see the fish. You can see all these awesome people. And then the cobblestone. Gosh, it doesn't get more grease than this, doesn't it? My new favorite street for like half art. <laughs> grease could get more grease, but it just got more grease than that. I'm really looking forward to cliff jumping, cliff diving, but we're on this hike and our leaders decided to go get coffee, so we're leading ourselves and we have no idea where we're going and we're walking in paradise like. Definitely, if I were a mountain goat, that would be heaven. You see me as a mountain goat? Cool. Mama, me, 
This is paradise. First steps into Greek water. Alright, here we go. It's so clear. I am digging it. So we're straight chilling. Straight. Chilling. This is harder than it looks. So you swim with three three limbs. Nothing says chill like reading a book on the edge in Greece with the beautiful scenery all around you. Ladies and gentlemen, the I best know. seats in the house tonight. Actually, today. <laughs> Got the emoji. Best friend. You are like a little little thing. <laughs> right, so we're not supposed to go past here and jump off of that. Go down there. But we're gonna do it because people have been doing it. And it looks pretty fun, it's like a cliff. It's like a rock, a bigger rock, and you jump off of it, cliff jumping, rock jumping, whatever you want to call it, we're gonna do it. say after all the adventure that I've had today of jumping off cliffs, off of hiking, swimming in the beautiful waters of the ocean or sea that's that's here and by traversing the city of Hydra, today has been a really good day. Not just because of the beautiful things and the amazing things that I've done, because of the beautiful people and amazing people that I've been hanging out with. Um, every single every single person has just been amazing, has been so open, has been a true friend. Even if we've known each other for just a week, just ten days, even if just two or three days. And I think that really says something, not just about me, but about humanity and stuff like that. I guess that's, a, that's an overarching theme in this, in this vlog, in this whole study abroad experience. Seeing the humanity, the smiles, the compassion that is in, 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 innate in everybody. It took a, it took a while to say that. <laughs> but it's something, it's something that I truly feel that I'm getting by coming to Greece, by having their culture, that relaxed culture, of just taking it easy, of relaxing, of yeah, sipping coffee with friends for two hours, and being okay with just chillaxing. It's a very beautiful thing, and I'm very glad that I'm here. And it's, it's a very good thing. It's a very refreshing lifestyle from the hustle and bustle of America. Peace. And at last, I see the light. The sky is new, and it's warm, real and bright. And you want to save money? Make your own lunch. I got a Nutella sandwich, and a ham, cheese, lettuce, and barbecue sauce sandwich to remind me of home. And I decided to try out rugby with your nieces over here, who has done rugby before. So here's the field where we practice on. It's pretty, it's pretty legit if I do say so myself. He got a nice track field. What, what can, uh, what can we expect? A lot of <laughs> hear that? Lots and lots of her. Pray for me. Okay, so the coach is South African. What? This 
just got 10 times cooler. <laughs> <laughs> You're not going to class? Oh my gosh! Get a Greek way, huh? Greek way. <laughs> <laughs>